Ladies and gentlemen, we have an exclusive coming right at you, right at your front door, okay? Open up the video and share it. Share, like, and subscribe to Deb Chanel's 48th World, okay? Just got this in from TamaraTattles.com. Go check her out. She dropped an exclusive on Portia Williams. She's pretty much saying Portia Williams has a hit with this pursuit of Portia. From what her sources is telling her, she was only supposed to have like three uh, episodes to her pursuit of Portia. But girl, boy, it got extended to eight episodes. And there's talks of season two. A season two. Okay. I'm like, Portia must be coming with the good, good. The good, good, good drama. Let's go on into the article and see what um, Tamara Tattles is talking about. Okay. her She puts exclusive good news for Portia Williams. Okay. Every day. There seems to be more Real Housewives of Atlanta news, and with each new cup of tea I get to sip on, I am surprised and or confused. Today's news about Portia Williams really surprised me. As we all know, Portia Williams failed to get the money she wanted and walked away from negotiations with Bravo. She seems to be putting all of her eggs in one basket, and that basket was pursuit of Portia. Personally, I could not fathom the logic behind the decision, and apparently, I was wrong. Today, my exclusive source saw the final cuts of the first two episodes of Porsche or Pursuit of Portia. The source doesn't really have strong opinions of any of the housewives and likely doesn't watch the show any more than the job requires. So, I was quite surprised by today's correspondence regarding. Portia Williams. Okay, they saying Portia Williams got a hit on her hands, y'all. This new show is going to be fire. Okay, according to my source, this special series is so good. I see why her new agents at U2A advised her to turn down the Real Housewives of Atlanta 14. She can easily get a second season of this. She is so candid about the Simon situation. Her mom, brother, Dennis, sister, and Simon bring so much to the table. It is essentially her own ensemble show. The network is trying their best to keep her in the Bravo NBCU family. I see a season two green light coming soon. Pursuit of Portia premieres in December on Bravo. Again, I didn't see that coming, but from the sound of things, this could be a long-running show for Portia Williams. And I'll be watching and recapping the first season. It's eight episodes. It actually started out as three, and clearly the Bravo suits loved it because it grew into eight. I anticipate the new season will have even more episodes. And she left the question, will you be watching Portia Williams' new show? I'm like, yes, I will. I sure will. We'll be reviewing and all of that. Okay? Because like I said, Portia be coming with the calm, the good good as well as Kenya. But she got her own little show now. She's going to be turning the heat up because she knows what makes good ratchet television program she knows she has studied it for so many years she knows what the people want and it seems like she gonna deliver yes and i'm still trying to figure out how dennis and simon are so buddy buddy when she was just trying to work it out with mr dennis and then simon swept in so if she can give us clarification we can make two and two make four easily so, my question to you all, what do y'all think about this new things with Portia? That's why she was like, shoot, I can make a cool billion. Well, not billion. I'm just exaggerating a little bit. But a cool 100 million off this thing. And it'll be totally me. I don't have to split it with these other women. And it's all about me that's giving me more coverage uh, throughout the universe. You know what I'm saying? She ain't thinking just the states. She's thinking the universe. 
she is a household name. Just like Nene put the stamp on Real Housewives of Atlanta and brought it to where it is now. Well, you know, giving you something to look at with the all black cast primarily, but <sighs> Portia, Portia, Portia. Ooh, and I don't know what she's going to be doing with Fat. I mean, I fell in love with him. Or so. What's her, what's her sister's name? Lauren. Okay, yeah. She just, she drags Lauren on with her. And I guess that's good. That's good. But I am trying to figure out the dynamics between them two. Because Dennis, I'm like, you really just let Portia go like that? You know, was it ending like that? Then Simon's who up there. You know, of course, both mamas fighting for their babies. Yes, they're yes they are. Okay, but Portia trying to come with the good good, and I I really don't think this man she's really gonna marry him. If she do, to me it seems like it's gonna be a contractual agreement, something similar to what Kenya and Mog had. I just don't see it, y'all. Y'all ain't gonna make me see it. I mean, it could be what it is, but it just don't seem kosher. It don't seem kosher. But uh, that's all I had of this exclusive news that just came across my social media feed. And I thought I would share it with you all before I head in to go say my prayers and go to bed. But remember, it starts in December. Which is a good time because that's right the holidays. Most people are not really working there. You know, trying to ease on into the holidays so we could be sitting up here rewinding rewatching replaying the pursuit of Portia the first or second episode and getting our kikis and our last at least hopefully she's bringing that to the table and not no other kind of mess that we be sitting up there looking at her like what you gonna let him play you like Cordell Dennis you gonna let old season Simon school you girl but anyway we must wait, we must see, we must reflect, and then we're going to come over here and do a video on it. You know what I'm saying? So, that's all I got to say. We we down for it. We are down for it. And I hope my other family on YouTube going to come over and watch my videos and get my interpretation of what I saw, what I felt was going on in those scenes or those first, second, third episodes we will be reviewing. Okay? But I'm going to bed now. And remember... Share and like and subscribe to my channel, okay? Thank you. Bye-bye.